Hello and welcome to Reading Journey. I'm Journey and I'm doing a, a collective reading for anyone who needs it. Um, I had a dream last night and um, I had a dream somebody was being set up and it looked like it's a job situation. So this is very career related. Um, you could work in the medical field. I saw, I saw a little bit of the medical field. You could work in an office. You could work as a teacher, definitely a teacher, okay? Or if you're like a teacher's assistant, or um, if it could be anything like that, I'm definitely your career. So even if it's a career I didn't mention, if this resonates with you, then definitely take it. If not, then throw it away, okay? Never make a reading fit. If it's for you, it'll just click. So the thing that I got was somebody is being set up. This person is very nice. You're a counselor. You could be a counselor. Um, anybody that works with students in any form or fashion. Um, and if you work with um, the public, I'm hearing that public, public health, um, students, um, uh, uh, anything like child protective services, anything like that, um, I definitely pick that up for you all. But... Um, yeah, they're, they're trying to set you up. You're a person who's trying to do the right thing or somebody in your environment, they're telling me that as well. But you're trying to do the right thing and these people are just hating on you. And there's a man and a woman involved. There's a man I saw specifically and then the woman was on the background. I couldn't really see her. So I, I'm thinking she's more hidden. You probably, you don't even, I'm hearing, you don't see it coming. And I did notice that they gave the person um, the option to quit. So they were like, you can have this option to leave if you'd like. Okay, so someone maybe try to offer you to leave. I'm um, hearing severance. So I don't, yeah. And I'm not really sure what you should do about that yet. So let's, I'm, that's why I'm pulling the cards. I'm using the Panther Oracle and we're gonna be using the Mahogany Tarot. And we might use the Enchanted Map Oracle, but Holy Spirit, tell us the overall energy. Protect our energy, those of, those of us who are of love of life, love and life of the highest vibration. What is going on? Tell me more. Evidence. Oh. Okay, so somebody could be trying to collect something against you. I feel more so they're trying to look for something. I don't feel they have anything on you. So what I'm picking up now, I'm picking it more thoroughly. I see 55, so there may even be conflict at the job. You know, oftentimes that should be our warning. When things are at our job where it's just like you are totally unhappy, and these people are attacking you or just always trying to accuse you of something or you're always catching the brink of stuff. It's either one or two things. You need to speak up if you have never spoken up. And if you're spoken up and you're not being listened to, the universe is trying to give you a red flag. Either a door is, there's a close on this. There's a door that's closing. It's time to go. I'm getting that as well. So I feel like the universe may be giving you a warning. Now, I'm not telling you to go ahead and quit your job or anything like that, that you have to trust your own intuition, okay? See the see the disclaimers below. But you have to trust your own intuition, honey, okay? But I feel like, and as I'm cleaning, I feel it's like they're trying to clean up some stuff. Maybe their budget is low. Um, maybe something's going on. Maybe somebody, there's a job too. Somebody wants to bring a friend in or a family member in or somebody that they think is better for the job to come in. It's just more of a favor thing. So I'm even hearing retaliation. So maybe you had said something about something that you didn't like and they got in trouble for it. And now they're coming after you, even though, listen, what we have to understand, I had to learn this the hard way. In a job, HR is not there for you. HR, human resources, they act like it. They smile. They put a pretty face on. Hi, yeah, we're here for you. HR, you got a problem, come to us. But they're there for the company. That's how they're trained. They're trained to protect the company, not you. Okay, I hate to break it to you, but these jobs. And you know, listen, I'm telling you what I had learned my own on my own was, and I see 44, these jobs, they don't owe you anything. All they owe you is a paycheck. I apologize for the noise. All they owe you is a paycheck and that's it. 
You you work for them, they give you the paycheck. That's all it is. No more, no less. They're not there to like you. They're not there to love your family. They don't care. They don't. Especially if you are in, if you're in a Western society, especially America. America is a, um, oh, what's the word I'm looking for? We're a consumer-based country. We are a, um, this is capitalism all day. You know, we are about spending, making money. That's all it's about. And recycle and start again. That's really what this is about. But do your history, do your research. If you want to find out about it and you're looking for it, look and you'll find what you're looking for. Um, and if you're not sure where to start, ask the divine to show you. But that's what this is about. Okay. So basically, again, another 55, you may want to look that up. Okay, that could mean two things for me. A cycle is completing and there's conflicts. You could be fighting against that. I'm getting some people are fighting against that because you want to stay. Maybe you're in the middle of the, um, maybe you're in the mid, if you're a teacher or a counselor or school or anything like that, maybe you're in the middle of the, the year and you don't want to stop there. And if, if that's the case, if this is something where you're on a contract basis, right? And the school year's gonna end, I'm not talking about people who got a six year contract or anything like that. If you know this is like a school contract, um, you know, something like that, you're a counselor, you work in schools or, you know, it's a certain time of year, then I would definitely, I mean, I cannot tell you to do, I can only suggest is I would be starting to look for another job after this season because they're definitely trying to pile up some type of um, um, evidence on you. So I would pray and ask the universe, God, source of mind, yeah, whatever you believe in, to just buy me enough time to be able to get out of here and find something else. And I would start building up that resume and I'd start just looking and seeing what's out there because they're definitely trying to set you up, sadly. Okay, so yeah, there's a queen of cups. I feel like that's who's in the background. The woman I was talking about could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. It could just be somebody who's very in her emotions. You see, she's very focused on that cup. I feel like that cup is you. I do. Um, very focused on you. They're very, they're a hater. They're a miserable, miserable person. I'm also here and pray for your enemy. So, and that's a hard thing to do. When somebody stabbed me in the back, you get to that place. But in the meantime, instead of trying to attack to get or retaliate, because it's not going to work, I feel somebody's like, I'm going to fight back. I'm going to go to the board. I'm going to, this is, this, this is more spiritual than it is physical. There's something about you. There's time, for, it's time for you to go. You've learned your lessons. It's time to move on. And I see 755 is coming to an end and you're going to keep getting conflict. Ace of Cups is reversed. This is not a card to have in the reverse, okay? Not a card to have in the reverse. Meaning you're not going to get wish fulfillment at this job at all. And it's going to be torture. It's going to get worse. You're going to be a lot of tears, a lot of frustration. You probably already have some tears, all right? If you hadn't, there will be if you continue to try to stay because God's blessing is not on this, okay? And I know what that feels like. A lot of times we just don't want to, we get comfortable. You know, we get comfortable. And it's hard. It's like, I don't want to start over. Some of you may have been in these jobs. I'm hearing 16 years. I'm hearing that for sure. 16 years, five years, four years, a year. You know, maybe you really like your class and coworkers, but um, I'm also hearing karmic. So what that means is, what I feel with that is, everybody's not, listen, you're going to continue to grow. Life is about growing. Those days of staying at a job for 20 years, 30 years is over. And retiring is over because it doesn't work. It doesn't work. Most of the people, when they retire, they either end up dead or they're so broken down that they can barely enjoy it. Okay? situation so a ten of pentacles is here that's nice let's see where this is going okay ten of pentacles knight of cups and the five of wands so yeah maybe this job pays you really really well i do see in the future i see what's up and coming is this job probably pays you very, very well. Or maybe you built a lot of wealth there. Maybe you have a really great 401k or 
whatever it is you have with this company, right? I also get a feeling of you're like, I don't know where else to go. There's nothing else out there. That's not true. There is. Do you have to start over? Yeah. I mean, I, I'm going to be honest. We, we're in a, we're in a time that we have to, unfortunately, start over. If you're not living your best life, if you're not, what I mean by that is if you're not living the purpose that the most high source God, Allah, whatever you believe in, is wanting you to live, you're not going to stay there. And what's happening is we're being all pushed into positions where we are, um, they're pushing us into a place where we have to do what's our soul's purpose, what brings us joy, what really makes us happy, what we signed up before, before we even came here. Okay, so I do see you with this Knight of Cups going, but I feel like, oh no, wait a minute, you're going into the Five of Wands here. Oh, if you're trying to offer an apology, you're an alliance, because I'm feeling that clear. I'm feeling that somebody's going to try to offer an alliance, it's not going to work. It's not going to work. It's going to be very chaotic. They don't like you, okay, and I don't mean to be mean. But they don't. Somebody does not like you. These people don't like you because you are, you're not like them. Okay, you're trying, somebody here is trying to do the right thing in the wrong setting. And yes, there may be children involved. I understand that. But you're going to have to pray for those children and keep it moving. Okay, uh, pray because it's not your job. Somebody here, I used to be like this. You feel like you need to be the rescuer. Everyone has their soul path. Trust me, those little souls, some of the, many of them have been here more than once, okay? Um, and God will take care of them. And if God's, and this is what I'm getting, and I had to learn this too. If God's not interfering, then neither should you. People have free will, and I know you're like, well, they're children, they're innocent. I understand that. I do. Pray for them. But you cannot um, grieve your soul's path because this is your path keyword your your path for other people and i understand i get it i get it i know what you're talking about i know how you feel i have been there right, tell me about the uh tell me about this uh let's go into the five of wands i'll hold it up too long tell me more about the five of wands please Actually, let's see, okay, I'm going to switch it up. Because this reading is going to run out. It stops me in 15 minutes. I do apologize. If you like the video, hit the like button. If you want to subscribe, subscribe for more. You can. You definitely can do that. But if our journey parts here, well, then that's okay. So thank you for allowing me on your journey. Personal are open right now. All right, let's get to the whole bit. Give me three more cards. Give me three more cards, please. Ooh. Okay. So that's too many. I will take this one, though. The last one that I saw. All right. Yeah, see? Ooh. Okay. I feel like... I feel two things with this card. <clears throat> One, there's a team of people. They're not working alone. Remember I said there's a man and a woman for sure that I saw. And they may get these speak, they may get some other people to turn against you because they're not gonna want to lose their jobs. I'm just trying to keep it real. People don't wanna mess up, you know, especially if you live in paycheck to paycheck. But I also feel that you've built an alliance with these people. These people are smiling, you I'm hearing they're smiling your face. So I'm hearing that too. These people are going to backstab you and you may feel like you built an alliance of friendship. You can't trust them right now. Everybody's fighting for their job. Somebody, they're, they're asking people to do things behind your back. If they haven't done it yet, it's coming. And you're going to stress yourself out. You're not going to get, you're going to, this is going to stress you out to the point of sickness. Don't do that to yourself, okay? But it, Brent, just be humble. Continue to be you, but do the steps that you need to do. Okay, that's what I hear clearly. It's time to go. At some point, it's going to be time to go. Again, I'm not telling you to leave. Trust your intuition. Ask God for guidance. Follow those steps, but know that people are trying to set you up. If you like this video, hit the like button. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Bye-bye. I'll be praying for you in this situation.